this video is for a pastor's or a minister's wife that's having a hard time finding friends. This video is also for a church member that want to develop a relationship with the pastor's wife and you may wonder why she is thin offish. After watching this video, you will understand her struggles and why she has them. I'm a pastor's wife. My husband started pastoring 29 years ago. So I guess I consider myself as a veteran. I have experienced a lot of different struggles as a pastor's wife. And one of my struggles has been finding friendships. And you may think to yourself, well, it's hard for anyone to find friendships. Yes, that is true, but it is harder on pastor's wives. And I'm going to tell you why. Some people have good intentions of wanting to be your friend and some people don't. And you have to figure out that person's intentions of wanting your friendship as a pastor's wife. First, I'm going to talk about the positive intentions. Some people want to be your friend because they genuinely like you. They like being around you and they want to get to know you. They consider you as good company. Some people want to be your friend because they want what you have. They want your life. They want your husband. They want to be a first lady. They are setting a trap for you and they want to get to know you because they want to figure out your weakness so that they can use it against you. They want to get closer to you so that they can get close to your husband. The things that I just shared with you are not things that I read or just making up. It's, it's things that I have experienced a couple times in my life as a pastor's wife. That's why we are so skeptical about who we become friends with. Because you have a lot of women that have the wrong motive of wanting to be your friend. So it makes us to where we're kind of standoffish and we're uh, suspicious and maybe even a little paranoid. And that is why. Because it's more like one thing I have learned in life over the years as being a pastor's wife. It's like, seem like whenever you let your guards down, then that's when the enemy tried to step in and take over your life. Girl, I can tell you some stories. Something sounds like it's fiction, but I actually experienced it. I don't have enough time in this video. I think it's one of those things to where I will have to write a book about it. What it's like being in ministry. You would be surprised. Everybody that joins your church, they're not there for good reasons. A lot of them come there just to try to take your spot. I have a question for you. Do you have a hard time developing friendships? And if you do, I would like to know why. I'm having my first webinar, July the 29th. My webinar is for new pastor's wives and it's also for someone that's married to a minister and your husband is considering becoming a pastor. There's only 25 slots available, so make sure you register. I will have the information in my description box below. If you are a new pastor's wife and you are having issues with being a pastor's wife, schedule a one-on-one -on -one consultation with me. I will also have the information in my description box below as well. If you like my message and you want to support me, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel and also click on the notification bell. That way you will be notified every time I upload a video. I hope this video helped you and make sure you stay tuned for my next upload, a part two of how to find friendship for pastor's wives. Thank you for tuning in. Bye.